Lord Jesus Christ, or will we be fashioned after the similitude mm -hmm. of this world? Yes. God has clearly said, love not the world, and neither the things in the world, for all that is in the world is the lust of the eye, the lust of the flesh, and the pride mm -hmm. of life. Amen. Yes. In many yes. cases, the pride of life has overtaken us, but brothers and sisters, I can hear the Spirit of the Lord saying that he who humbles himself, mm -hmm. God will exalt. Mm -hmm. But he who exalts himself will be a Based, we're brought down. Mm -hmm. What are you saying, Jesus? I'm clearly telling you that behold, I beheld Satan mm -hmm. fall as lightning. That's right, he sought to exalt himself above the throne of God, and we're living in a dispensation of time where men are seeking to exalt themselves. But my brother, let me tell you, my sister, let me tell you this. I've learned from experience the way up is down. Yes. Praise be to God. And before we go any further, we do wish to acknowledge our sponsors that have diligently stood with us to make this broadcast possible. And as always, I open the door of opportunity for those of you that often say that moments of inspiration, uh, perfecting the saints has been a blessing to you or my brothers and sisters. What better way can you prove that than to sow back into the ministry? We've been on the air for 10 years now, and we have been collectively asking all of our brothers and sisters that would stand with a $10 sacrificial offering to sow into moments of inspiration. Now, if God leaves on your heart to sow more, listen, we would appreciate that too. But as I told you before, we want to stay on the air at least for one hour so that we can create a dialogue. Open up the phone line. Give you a chance to express the necessities of what you feel the body of Christ needs to be focusing on in these days in which they were living. And for those sponsors that have stood with us already, we would like to acknowledge uh, Brother Carter. That's right, Carter's Bush Hog Service. Now, you've bought all those acres of land and uh Listen, you don't know what to do. You've got bushes and weeds and Johnson grass growing everywhere. You've got six, seven, ten acres. You don't know what to do. Well, listen, Brother Carter with Carter's Bush Hog Service is there to accommodate you. Whether it is commercial, whether it is residential, Brother Carter is there. That's right. No job is too large or too small. And while the Lord is giving us this blessed weather that we have, we know that those weeds and grass are growing up just as fast as you cut them down. Well, Carter, uh, Bush Hog Service wants to be there to assist you. You want to clear that land out and you want to get it cleared out quick, fast, and in a hurry, well, Brother Carter can help you. Brother Isaiah Carter can be reached at area code 662-254-6232, or you can call him at area code 662-515-1482. That's Carter's Bush Hog Service. No job is too large or too small. Give him a call. doesn't matter how many acres you have. I believe he will not leave until the job is finished. Amen. Commercial or residential, you can call him right now. Tell them you heard about it on Moments of Inspiration, Perfecting the Saints. Also, my friends around Greenwood, don't forget about the Oddity Shop, Pond and Home Accessories, 109 East Church Street, everything to help make your happy house a home sweet home. They're also a bill payment center, 30-day payday loan, car title loan, Church Street check cashing. It's all right there at the Oddity Shop Complex. They even have cars there. That's right. In-house financing is available. Go by, check them out. Tell them you heard about it on Moments of Inspiration, Perfecting the Saints. My friends around the Indianola area, you're looking for good biblical needs and biblical aids, well, Docs, Trophies, Gifts, and Music is the place to go, 112 Main Street in Indianola, Mississippi. He can help you with all type of Bible study guides. He's also have the ministerial license, has the uh, communion refills, the communion trays, the offering trays. Also, if you need musical instruments, Doc is very uh, instrumental in helping you to get those instruments that you need, drumsticks, maybe keyboards. All you need to do is go by, check him out, 112 Main Street in Indianola. Indianola, Mississippi, Dr. Trophy's Gifts, and Music. Also, my friend, you're looking for lawn care. That's right. You'd probably like to see your lawn your lawn in the yard of the month. Well, listen, my friends, that can happen to you. You need to get in touch with m and B Lawn Service. That's right. They are a full care lawn service. Maybe you're tired of getting out every day sprinkling that grass. Well, they also install sprinkler systems. Amen. All year round, m and B Lawn Service is there to assist you. You've got leaves need picked up? No problem. m and B Lawn Service can assist you with that. No job is too large. No job is too small. You can go by there, get in touch with Mr. Mike Bobbitt, and you can call him right now at 897-7451 
or 897-7457. It's very simple. Get in touch with M&B Lawn Care Service. They're there to assist you. Again, they can install the lawn sprinkler systems for you. They are there to pick up the leaves, whatever. They can do it for you. Tell them when you get in touch with them that you heard about it on Moments of Inspiration, Perfecting the Saints. My friends around the Chicagoland area, listen, for that next banquet party, for that next family reunion, that next uh, summer gathering, because summer still is lingering on, I want Lee and Eddie's, Lee and Eddie's catering to be a part of the festivity. That's right, my friends around the Chicagoland area. Maybe you're having that retirement party, maybe that bed, bridal shower, that baby shower. Let Lee and Eddie's assist you. They are serving the greater Chicagoland area, and you can get in contact with them by dialing them at area code 630-350-3500. Amen. Let them be a part of the festivities. Listen, they've got all type of mouth-watering banquets there for you. Birthday cakes. Uh, listen, they even help you with that wedding. They help you plan those weddings. So you can let Lee and Eddie's catering know that you heard about it. And my friends, listen, maybe you can't pick us up on the radio always, but you can take moments of inspiration with you outside of the Greenwood area. Simply by accessing us through the World Wide Web, you can go to wgrmradio.org. RG. Click on the Listen Live button and you will get moments of inspiration every Saturday at 2 o'clock p.m. And to our listeners, our Pal Talk listeners around the continental United States of America, listen, we wanted to say a big old hearty God bless you to all of you that have been made possible through our technician up in the Chicagoland area, Brother Michael Green. We thank and praise God for him who have connected us with the Pal Talk listeners. We want to let you know, my brothers and sisters, that we are praying for you. Amen. That's right. Many of you have expressed that, said, Bishop Townsend, we want to help you get on an hour. Well, my friends, listen, very accessible again. If you'd like to sow into this ministry and you also have what's called a PayPal account. You can access the Moments of Inspiration Outreach Ministry by simply going to uh, the email Bishop K L Townsend at AOL dot com. want to let you know that we are a non-profit organization, which means that we are registered with the Internal Revenue Service. We are a 501c3 entity, which means that your contribution is tax deductible. You can write it off on your taxes at the end of the year. We'll be glad to give you that statement. As with all of our brothers and sisters, so into the ministry so that we can be exactly what God has called us to be. Praise God. So on that note, we're going to go on just a little bit further. Amen. We were getting in the Word of God on last week. Amen. And we're just going to just briefly reiterate on it again, Lady Thompson, because one thing about it, Jesus said, uh, will I find faith yes. when I return upon the earth? And, and oftentimes, Lady Thompson, when we look around and see uh, the depletion of what's happening around us on a day-to-day -day basis, amen. Time is running out. Oh, yes. And we've got to equip and infuse God's people with the mentality that God wants them to operate in the kingdom. Why stand you around idle all day? Well, I'm not a preacher. I'm not a minister. Yeah. I'm not a this. I'm not a usher. Brothers and sisters, that's no excuse. Every excuse that you make on that line, you're like the man who had the one talent and he sat on that talent. There's no time to sit on your talent. Everything that God has given us, he has freely given us so that we can utilize it and access it in the kingdom of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And so the scriptures has declared this, Lady Thompson. It said, these signs shall follow only the bishops that believe. Them that believe. Oh, wait, it, it didn't say only the apostles that believe? No, everyone. Them that believe. Wait a minute. He's got to be... No, the, no, no, Lady Thompson. got to be talking about the evangelists. The, no, I know. I'm sorry. I got it wrong. Only the prophets uh -huh. that believe. That's yeah. what he said. These signs shall follow the prophets and the prophetesses that believe. No, them that believe. Brother, whosoever. <laughs> my sister, my brother, that means you. Yes. Amen. You shall receive power after that the Holy Ghost has come upon you. And if you are indeed a spirit-filled, born-again, baptized believer, it is essential and imperative that you understand that you began to utilize what God has given you. Yes, being born again is exactly what it says. Uh, that, that, that sinful nature of your old man has been eradicated. And so now, in the born-again experience, you are experiencing a new life. The sinful man has been given a clean slate, and so now you are at liberty to go forth and exercise the things of of the Lord Jesus Christ. You know, Lady Johnson, we just recently became grandparents. And in the in the essence of becoming grandparents, you know, the joy of seeing a newborn baby when it comes into this life gives you so great joy. 
Because they grow so fast right between you. But mm -hmm. one of the things that I noticed, kind of like King Solomon sat back and he noticed even the ant and, and different uh, everyday things of life, I began to notice that that child began to look at its faculties. Mm -hmm. And if you ever watch a newborn child as they grow and they begin to look at what they have, have sometimes those little rascals, ladies and gentlemen, will look at their fingers. 